Five four four. Yes. So Vinod Kumar, five four four. Honorable Minister of Health. So five forty four A to D. A statement is laid on the table of the house. Yes. So thank you, Speaker. Sir. sir, I have gone through the reply statement uh, placed before the house, sir. Sir, my original question was: What are the initiatives taken? With regard to the communicable and non-communicable diseases, sir. Yes. Sir, nothing has been said about diabetes, which is a non-communicable disease, sir. Diabetes. Sir, the World Health Organization has declared India as the diabetic capital of the world. They declared India. Sir, today there are about 3.5 crores of patients in the country. and every fifth patient who is at who is going to the physician is a diabetic patient sir yes sir i would like to know from the minister in view of the gravity of the problem yes. what steps government have taken or proposed to take to control diabetes whether government proposed to launch a national program for control of diabetes sir okay Yes, Mr. Minister. Sir, press. I appreciate the honourable member's concern, and he is right, sir. Yes. Today, India is on the path to becoming the diabetic capital of the world, and because the lifestyle diseases, sedentary lifestyles, and due to modernisation. But the, the question he asked was, what are the steps the government had taken? We had given a list of the steps taken, and now, so what are the steps the government is going to take, sir? due to the increase on the spurt of the diabetes and cardiovascular cases in the country yes. the government is going to uh, have a national program on diabetes cardiovascular and stroke by this year and in principle approval of the honorable prime minister and the planning commission has already been given for that program and through this program we are going to go on a massive awareness program and screening for uh, both these diabetes and cardiovascular and also stroke and uh, sir today diabetes in the urban area the incidence is about about uh, uh, 11 to 12% which is very alarming and in the rural areas it is about 3 to 5% then again it's very alarming for us and we have to take action and we are doing all uh, steps necessary for creating awareness basically for this second supplementary sir my second supplementary is with regard to the non communicable uh, sir communicable disease sir that is uh, tb sir Sir, under uh, I have gone through the performance budget 2005-2006 of the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare. Sir, under the revised National TB Control Program, at the end of third quarter of 2004, the annualized case detection rate of TB cases was 144 per lakh population, sir. So that the targets were fixed by the ministry as 135 per lakh, sir. And the new and the new sputum positive case detection was also. Uh, detected were 56 per lakh, as against the target of 53, sir. Sir, I would like to know from the minister, sir, uh, since the targets set by the government under the program have been surpassed, whether the targets have been fixed realistically, and what is the basis of criteria for fixation of these targets? Okay. Sir, further, owing to the incidence of TB cases in the country, particularly among the women, and since TB is curable. whether government proposed to set higher targets under the program okay. during oh. the current financial year okay. for the detection rate and new sputum detection rate of oh. tb sir okay so the revised national tb control program rntcp is one of the successful performing programs sir and uh, under this program we have initiated a new methodology called dots directly observed treatment short course which incidentally was founded in india by the bangalore and the chennai institute and adopted by the who and propagated worldwide so under this dots program today more than a billion people have been covered and due to the dots program sir we have been able to drastically reduce the incidence and the deaths occurring due to tb and these the targets have been definitely scientifically due through the icmr which is the premier most network uh, institution in the country they have been uh, uh, proposed and we are going according to the schedule sir sir i would like to inform through you 
that's a, we are saving, every year we have saved about 7 lakh lives approximately and under the DOTS regime, about till date 4 million people have been put, put up under this and even though we have about 1 point million new cases every year and out of yes. that about seven, eight, 8 lakh cases are uh, spear positive. But this DOTS program, it covers nearly about 90 to 95 percent of the country and we are definitely uh, going all out to tackle this uh, huge problems.